Another way to help with development of craft sites and debug sites and problems is using the Yi Debug Toolbar. Now, as you know from the introduction to the course, Craft is built on top of the Yi PHP framework. And that framework offers a toolbar for debugging and Craft has implemented this as well. To access it, we need to go to our user account in the control panel. And then under preferences, there's the debug toolbar section. And we can choose whether we want the toolbar to show in the front end, the control panel, and whether we want to profile twig templates when dev mode is disabled. So I'm going to enable all three and save it. Now at the bottom right, you see I have this new toolbar here. And if I click the arrow to expand it, I get information about this page and the request. I can learn about the Ajax request, how many events were sent, the users, the routing, the status code return, it was a 200, how many items in the log, 71 messages. Of course, we're running here in dev mode, so there's going to be a lot more. Whether there's any deprecations I have to worry about, the time it took to render it, the memory it used, and the number of database queries and asset bundles. Now, the nice thing, this is also available on the front end too. So if I reload, let me actually go to a page. You can see I have it here. We just have our generic welcome page. It's the same thing. So now I can inspect both the front end and the back end. Now this is handy if I'm working on a plugin and I need to figure out why something isn't working, I could use this. On the front end, it's really great to keep an eye on how heavy and database intensive our page is. Like this one has 28 queries. If I wanna learn more about something, I just click on it and that expands up into a pane here and I have all sorts of access to things. I can sort by things. I can just do show queries. I can just do insert queries here or just select queries and start to understand what is happening. And I can also go through to my router and you can see the rules that have been tested before a match was found. And this is what Craft does with every request. And if I'm debugging, oh, why isn't this template showing? I can go through the routing here and understand what happened and when it was pulled up and why it was or wasn't showing. So this is the Yi debug toolbar. Now the handy thing is if I go back to my config file and I'm going to go to my environment, let's say I change this to production. So here in production, if I reload, I'm no longer uh, running in dev mode, but because I'm logged into the control panel and my user has debug toolbar enabled because we enabled at the user level, that means I can sneakily inspect the problems and see stats about the site and maybe look at deprecation messages, at error messages, without having to enable dev mode, I can get all that information right here in the toolbar. And that's a really handy way of kind of sneaking in as a logged in user and seeing some of the things that the site is doing. So I encourage you to have the debug toolbar turned on for your admin account. And at least while you're developing the site, you should have it on along with dev mode, but you might want to have it on all the time. So when you log into the site, you get this little toolbar that you can expand and keep an eye on the site stats as you work on it.